All four students are in custody this evening after a gun went off in a high school classroom in San Francisco. The incident prompted a tense lockdown at Balboa High School. A photo taken inside one classroom shows students huddled together with the door blockaded. Another shows students crouched down on the floor with their phones. Balboa High School sits along Cayuga Avenue in the city's Mission Terrace neighborhood. KPIX 5 reporter Emily Turner is there now with new information. Emily. Yeah, we now know what these students are being investigated for. All four of them originally it was three. We now know that it is four. There is a fourth in police custody. One of them is being investigated for the unlawful discharge of a firearm. The other three for accessory after the fact. Of course, we're waiting on more information from San Francisco police. But as you can imagine, it's been a very tense day here. Amia Tautui doesn't take these moments for granted, and it's not just because she spent hours behind crime scene tape wondering about her boys inside Balboa High School. It's really hard because we just lost one of my family members due to gun violence in San Francisco, so it's really emotional to even experience this and to even go through it. Her cousin Joe, an anti-gun violence activist, was shot and killed just two and a half weeks ago. So when she found out her son's school was locked down because of a gun, she panicked and got there as soon as she could. After waiting for hours with dozens of other anxious parents, police secured the scene. There are three subjects who are in custody related to this incident, and there was also a firearm recovered from the scene. The three suspects, police say, are all students. From this Chopper 5 video, you can see each of them walked out of the school, including one on crutches. They were cuffed and put into a patrol car while students sheltered in place in their classrooms. I was very scared. That's why I called my parents first. One person was hurt with minor injuries. Police don't know if that injury is related to a gun or not. But for Amia and her family, today is an unwelcome reminder of pain and a reason to hold on to one another. Just let them cherish my kids. I appreciate them. Give them a big so hug. I give them a big hug, you know. Like I said, it's so emotional. And police have now released information about that one injury. We do know it was a female student here at the high school, but it was not related to that gun going off. It was just a back injury. She was treated, released to her parents, and will be okay. Uh, as for the students here who may be traumatized by what happened this morning, uh, Balboa High School says they will have counseling services available for those who need them. Reporting live in San Francisco, Emily Turner, KPIX 5.